領域転換無料空襲
Yet during our flight, we came face to face with a man thought dead. Red I was trying to think of the first part. I knew it was red. I mean, I knew it was 13. I just couldn't think of red. Red 13. Sephiroth. Before he could be stopped, Cloud's foe fled with the corpse of Genova. The cataclysm from the stars and the catalyst of our plight. Eventually, we too made good our escape. Pursuing troopers defeated, we raced toward Midgar's edge. Yet Sephiroth once again intervened. <laughs> yes, he did. Deafening screams rent the air. Whispers, the arbiters of fate, descended upon the city. Before their imposing wall, Aerith warned us. This was Destiny's crossroads. Yep. Yes, it was. Every moment, every oh, action, every step taken had all been problems here. Was wielded. To fight them was to break free. On the other side of fate, Sephiroth waited, the whispers undulating within him. Cloud brought his blade down upon his rival, sundering Ooh. destiny. Ooh. Fight one. The shackles of destiny broken. We stood before the unknown, a world of boundless freedom. It was there, beyond where fate could follow, that a new journey began. All right, we're gonna get started. If you know anything about the original PlayStation, what one? um final fantasy 7 playstation it was one or two early two late one if you know anything about the early game you should know two things one obviously this is a remake um and they've done a few things differently with the story so the story is not going to be exactly the same as it was back then and two i do not care that i did not play the original this is better Let's continue. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. Hold on. We, we, we already here. Oh, this is the end of the last game. Y'all see me? I'm getting up in my seat like, all right, let's go. What, what am I, what am I doing? This is the, this is the beginning of the ending of the last game. I'm here on the Midgar Expressway. The scene is indescribable. Countless buildings have been leveled, and part of the road has collapsed. My gosh. The smoke rising from the rubble is reminiscent of a funeral pyre. Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the... I the fall of the Sector 7 plate, culminating in this unprecedented destruction caused by a massive tornado which swept through Sectors 0, 1, and 2. After a briefing with Shinra investigators, yeah, tornado. Mayor Domino released a statement declaring the tornado to be, quote, weather warfare perpetrated by the infamous insurgent group known as Avalanche. The administration also suspects the involvement of Wutai, and has begun investigations into the matter. <sighs> Bruh, they made this destruction look way worse.
they made that look so much worse in this game. In the first game, it looked bad, but th that, oh gosh, just zooming through it like that. Whew. For those of you who don't know, this city is made up of two levels. There's an upper level and a lower level. And the upper level is held up by plates um, that have certain supports. In the last game, they dropped the support. They broke the support on Sector 7, which is where uh, most of the game kind of took place. That's like the homeland of most of the game. And they dropped the plate. And it killed thousands of people. The boy, Zach. Look at him. Why he tore up like he was the one fighting? He just got there. If I remember correctly, tell me if I'm wrong. Now I think he, I think he had just shown up at the end of the game. It's been a minute since I played Rebirth. I mean remake. Excuse me, remake. I was looking at Rebirth when I said that. Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the. It, uh, the fall of the Sector Seven plane. Boy, that tornado really did a number on the city. I found another reactor blew up, which must have been caused by the tornado. Man, when it rains, it pours. As you can see, oh, over there. Amidst the wreckage of the expressway, search and rescue operations are already in progress. We still have one soldier. Right. That soldier, armed with a buster sword, highly dangerous. Uh oh. I repeat. The fugitive is an ex-soldier, armed with a buster sword. Uh -huh. Back over here! Get him on board! Press for takeoff! The rescue team has pulled people from the rubble! Ooh. Quick! Get the camera off him! Come on! This way! Contact the SAR team! Targets have been secured! We are exfilling via Hilo now! Move it! We're taking off! Wear it. Hey! Turn that off! Oh, caught him! The survivors are being taken away! I can't hear him! I'm going to And he was never seen again. Nor was that guy. They're, they died. <laughs> Excuse me. Could you look after my friend? Just for a bit. Too much Mako. But he'll be fine. <laughs> hey! You mean to tell me she didn't just start screaming? Hey, Buster Sword, Beck Soldier looking type dude. Aerith! I'll let you know people don't listen. Or oh, she's just afraid she could attack. She might have been afraid. Ooh, it's a lot going on right now. Hello. Oh, Red said, uh uh, get me up out of here. That don't sound good. Oh no! Okay, bet, bet, bet. Oh, this is lit. Okay, um, <laughs> this game looks so good. Okay, can I break stuff? Can I? Can I break stuff? No, I can't break anything. Okay, this is this is speed time. They're like, hey, I need you to go faster. Got it. Got it. Nope. Nope. No tacking. Nope. None of that. Okay, I can't do anything. Okay, I will need to, how do I, I guess I can't pause anything. I don't have any control right now, except for a minor pause button. Okay, okay, hop over. Okay, I can't run. I guess it's just natural running. I'm trying to figure out, could I run? Hey, hold on. Hey, 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 hold on. Hey, back up. Oh my gosh, goodbye. Oh, oh my gosh, was that like, was that me? Hey, come on. Yeah, okay, you, you're done. Come on. No, sir, stop that. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. Get some help. Stop it. I like how he uses his foot in the fight. I love it. Oh, oh, uh, yeah, y'all gonna have to fix that square. Oh gosh, I couldn't see nothing. Use it then, big boy. Oh, boy. 
Oh! Oh, we, we, we. Let's get it. Word, word. <laughs> let's get it. Okay, Zach. No, how about you don't get him? Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. Yeah, okay, that's the button I was looking for. Where's my dodge button? Oh my gosh, Zach. Oh my gosh, I love it. I can dodge at any moment. Oh my, put this down, bro. Oh, snap, nope. Put this down. I need you to stop with the flamethrower, bro. I need you to stop with the flamethrower, brother. Okay, he's done. He's done. Okay, come here. Me. Oh my gosh. Next, how did you get another flamethrower? Bro, sit down. Say no thank you. Pull him out of there, bro. Do you not know who that is? I guess he doesn't. In the grand scheme of things, he might not know who that is. You're not searching very well. This is so messed up. All of it. But I'm back now, Aerith. I'm back. What is that? Some type of materia? Tell the rest of us about you and your buddy Sephiroth. Sure. If Tifa doesn't mind. Me? Yeah. No problem. It's... It all started five years ago. I was 16 at the time. There was hardly any work for soldiers back then. And what little there was, it was boring as hell. My heart wasn't in it. Then, out of nowhere, a job of a lifetime came up. A mission with Sephiroth. Trying to be quiet for those who are actually trying to hear the story. Um, but we know that we've done this part already. So I wonder if they came up with some type of uh, cinematic for this. Hey, man. Okay. Now, we're not skipping anything because they could add added stuff or this could be like a just they do a cutscene for the whole thing instead of playing through it. I wish I could help, but never been motion sick. Sorry, man. Ready to do this? Yeah. Just in case I include this in the video, if you if you've seen the uh, demo playthrough when I played through it, you can go ahead and just fast forward a little bit. Wrong. Say, I'd like to be briefed on the mission at some point. Because if it's another one of those Turks gigs, you can let me off right here. Really? Finally make first, and what do they do? Call a ceasefire with Wutai, stealing my shot at glory. I didn't join Soldier to be an errand boy. I joined up so I could be a hero, like you. Well, our mission is to survey a rundown reactor. Another one of those Turks gigs. <sighs> Fine. Job's a job, I guess. 
Where is it? Nibelheim. Nibelheim? That's where I grew up. Got some beads in our dwell! Let's go. I don't mind doing this part again, though. Fighting with Sephiroth is absolutely crazy. Absolutely nuts, brother. You take one, I'll take the other. Sleep. Here, done. Goodbye. Pay attention, Cloud. I love the attention to detail. This, like this being a younger Cloud, he is not as Wait in the truck. as no way. I guess cold-hearted slash like ruthless and um. He's not as attentive as he is in the old game. Okay, brother. How do I block again? I'm trying to remember how to block real quick. Oh, R1, not... But yeah, you could tell he was a little bit more playful back then. He was a little bit more straightforward. But like after all of this stuff that's happened, he became a little bit more cold-hearted, a little bit more straightforward. A from the rest of us. Like I'm not trying to deal with all this extra stuff. Nibelheim. That's where they built the first reactor. Right? See? See? Yeah. See? It all started in the fall. Something was wrong with the reactor, and the whole village was up in arms. Talk of strange new monsters on the mountain only made things worse. People were scared, desperate. The villagers tried to take care of the monsters themselves, but it was no good. They ended up calling Shinra. So the company sent help. The best they had. Forgot he said that. Right? A mother named Genova. She died shortly after I was born. My father. Oh, there. Genova? Like from the Shinra building? Yeah. Yes. Don't worry. I'm getting to that. So this is new. Like, there's some new things in this <laughs> that wasn't in the demo. <laughs> so, I tell y'all what. We're like 30 minutes in and I ain't really done anything, but that's how big this game is going to be. So, I know I said that the first episode is probably not going to be edited, but due to this specific situation, the demo has already been played. There's been a lot of stuff that happened in the demo. Y'all already seen that. If anything crazy happens in this part that did not happen in the demo, I will include it in the video. But until then, I'm just going to play through the demo part again. And then we'll we'll cut that out of the original, and then we'll keep going from there. So, y'all won't see the the demo unless there's anything new that they didn't have in a demo that you know. But I'll just play through it anyway if it lets me. It may not even let me, but we'll see. We'll, when we get there, you'll see. Y'all, you'll see the cut. <laughs> I followed Sephiroth all the way back to the reactor. Dad and I had gone there to hide. Sephiroth showed up. Dad decided that he was going to confront him. Dad. 
It was Sephiroth, wasn't it? He did this, didn't he? <laughs> Sephiroth. Soldiers. Mako. Shinra. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this! <laughs> who robbed you of the planet. Your planet. But there's no need to be sad, Mother. Because I'm here for you. Now and forever. killed my mom. You killed Tifa. My village. My home. <laughs> they were mine by right. This planet too. For I have been chosen. I believed in you. No. Not you! Whoever the hell you are!
Wow. I can't remember. The rest is a blank. The hell it is? What happened? It was all over the news. I remember watching it with my mom. They wow. They missing during a training exercise. But then, the story changed. A couple days later, they started reporting that he was killed in action. Yeah, that was it. The news outlets are nothing but Shinra mouthpieces spewing propaganda. Only dumbasses believe that shit. Question. Does that make me a dumbass? Uh, I didn't say that. What I meant was... Screw Shinra for manipulating honest folks. <laughs> it doesn't matter what they said back then. Sephiroth was in Midgard. We fought him. Whatever happened, he's alive. Don't know about alive so much as around. But why come back now? After five years, doing who knows what. Because he wants to finish what he started. He wants to reclaim his birthright and rule over the planet with Jenova at his side. After five years? Not to sound like a broken record, but it's really bothering me. Well, what's bothering me is all this Genova stuff. Excuse me. Guess the travel or something really did a number on my back. Feels as stiff as a board. Let me take a look. Wow. You weren't kidding, were you? Let's get you back to the room. Yeah, let's just call it a night. No amount of guesswork will get us any closer to the truth. So how about we give our heads a rest? Uh, oh, no, you don't. That bed's mine. Sweet dreams. See you tomorrow. Ain't he gonna catch the bed on fire? And his tail on fire. <laughs> hey, Aerith, you awake? Barely. Why? I was wondering, <coughs> what's Cloud been doing these past five years? Where's he been? And you're asking me this? Just had a feeling you'd know. Probably did at one point. All that stuff was taken from me, though. Or maybe erased? By whispers? Yeah. Maybe that's why. Why what? This is gonna sound crazy, but as far as I know, Cloud was never in Nibelheim five years ago. What? Excuse me? What? What? He was never there? Cloud, you up? Oh, I need them to explain that. I need what? Huh? He was never there. Sorry, did I wake you? Nope. What's going on? Oh, uh, 
It's nothing, really. There's just something I need to ask you. So, can we talk? Sure. Great, but not here. Follow me. Anything for Tifa, I gotta say. Why is this man always showing up? Bro. You know that I killed her. Huh? So, who is she? Huh? Or rather, what is she? Huh? Where does she, where does she go? Oh, this is the only way to go, okay. All right, first of all, before we go any further, I, I know it for, for y'all it looked like a few seconds have passed. For me, two hours have passed. Now, I decided how, okay, that is something that needs to be explained too though. I went from level 40 to level 15. In the demo, you're level 40, I guess, but um, whatever. I played through the demo again. They gave me the option to choose to whether I wanted to play through it again or whether I didn't want to play it again. I played through it again. Reason why is because I just kind of wanted to get re-familiarize myself with the controls a little bit, and I felt like that was the perfect little tutorial slash introduction to the game to do so. So I played through it again, and I just kind of resumed right where that ended. So again, if you want to watch the uh, demo playthrough, uh, it's on the channel. You can go and watch it on the channel. It is under, it's going to be in the same playlist as this uh, episode, the first episode. And um, yeah, if you want to go watch that, feel free to go watch it and then come back to this. Um, this is the beginning of the first, um, the true first episode. So uh, I'll be a little bit transparent. There's going to be a few chops and cuts here. Um, today has been a little bit of a weird kind of day when it comes to scheduling, but I will be finishing and I will, there will at least be a lot, a lot, I, I, don't know, I can't talk right now. There will at least be about an hour, hour and a half worth of content in this first episode. Um, but I will play up until, um, maybe 20, uh oh, excuse me, maybe about 20 or so more minutes. And then I have to leave. But then when I come back, I will continue playing some more and all of that will be here. So it will look like I cut something. But more than likely, it will just be a break and um, joining right back into the content right afterwards. So you won't tell the difference. I will, but you won't. Let's get right back into it. All right. Following Tifa. Tifa, my, my, my bride, my wife. This is this is this is true love. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Up here. Yeah, I, I don't care about the people who ship. Cloud and Aerith. No, Aerith belongs with Zack. That's my boy's girl. Cloud can't have her. But he has Tifa. He doesn't need Aerith. This is baby girl. Look at her. Gorgeous. Look at her. Do you think Midgar's over there? <laughs> Disclaimer. I know she's I know she's an animated character. Video game. I know. I get it. Shoot. Don't think too hard. That night, five years ago. At the reactor, I saw you lying there. Saw your wound and all the blood. I figured it was too late. Yeah? <sighs> Wait, what are you implying? That I died? That I'm some kind of imposter? having this conversation with you but here we are here look my scar that proof enough after you left Zongon found me he's the one who brought me to the clinic he risked his life carrying me out of the reactor and down the river wasn't just him though. There's the doctor who operated on me all night and the nurses who looked after me for days on end. I'm here now because they were there for me then. And where were you again? In fact, where have you been this whole time? For five years. 
You know I can't tell you that. Of course you can't. Sorry, I just need some space. Whoa! Whoa! Oh no! Okay, we're gonna have to restore all of this because this ain't happening. Yeah, you, you ended the first game with no, no, no love, my boy. No love at all. You go end this game with somebody. Look, look at me. You, you look. You, you understand me? You gonna end this one with somebody? Okay. Golly, ruining everything. Freak, bro. No, I can't tell you that. Man. I thought we could just pick up where we left off. Like nothing had changed. But I guess I was wrong. Guess so. I was so <sighs> glad to see you again. But maybe I shouldn't have been. I thought we were supposed to have the choices in how we talk to these. How did we talk to each character? You two fight. Cause what the frick was that? And then you're just gonna lie to Barrett. Oh, I see why they gave. I see why they gave us the ability to restore to to do relational stuff with everybody. Because this is atrocious, bro. That <laughs> that boy Cloud has no relational awareness, bro. No emotional awareness and no social awareness. Oh my gosh. We got a lot of work to do. Good night. Copy. Oh my gosh. I mean, I understand. I do understand if it's like his. I mean, I don't understand. I, I can't say I understand because he hates Shinra now. They all hate Shinra now. So if it was through Shinra why he couldn't say where he'd been the last five years, then it shouldn't be. If it was because of Shinra, he, why he couldn't say that, then it shouldn't be a problem for him to, saying something now because it's like, you no longer work for Shinra. You don't longer have to keep anything classified for Shinra because you hate Shinra. We all have been fighting Shinra for the last two games. So I don't get it. I don't understand. Nice. <laughs> Tomorrow is another day. Mm. As right as you are, my friend. That ain't how it works. Never meet your heroes. Kind of have a point. Most, for the most part. What's this? A gift from our humble establishment. Though it may not look like much, it should help you to break the ice with those you meet. Queen's blood? Oh. Yeah, I, I don't really have a desire to play Queen's Blood. <sighs> I feel like I should learn how to play it just because there may come a time where you have to play them for to get some type of item or cosmetic or something. But I'm probably not going to play this throughout the story. At least not throughout the YouTube playthrough, but we'll learn it. Player takes turn placing a card on the board in one of the three lanes that span left to right. First, try placing a card on one of the highlighted tiles. Okay. This music is nice, though. Let's go, Cact. 
Yeah, let's go. Uh... Oh, okay. Okay, hold on. I see. I see. Hold on. No, no, let me go back. Can I go back? Uh, I don't. I don't want to place this one. I want to go back. It won't let me go back. Fine. Once a card is placed, this power is added to your lane total. New positions will also be added to the board, which are tiles with emerald ponds. Oh, no good. It's, it's power while the positions are card. While the positions a card will add to the board are indicated by the yellow squares. Okay. Okay, um... When one of your cards position tiles overlaps with the position you control, the position raises it in rank. As those are two pawns on that tile now, that position is ranked three cards. Positions equal to or higher than their rank, which is noted by the number of. Okay, on the top left corner of the card, thus, in order to play for a top card, you will have to raise it. Understood. As you now have a rank two position, try placing your rank two card on it. When one of your cards positions overlaps with one of your opponents, your you claim that position as yours. Note, however, that claiming a position will not raise its rank. You can keep track of who is winning a lane by looking at the, the points totals on each side of the board. Numbers on the left represent your power. Wow. Opponents, you may notice that some cards have tiles with red borders. There. These are the tiles that are affected by the card's ability. Please place cards effectively to make the most of your abilities and match the match power. All right, more lanes than your opponent. And your can I place a card you press with triangle? Pass both players pass consecutively. Consecutively the game will end. Got it. Raise the power of ally cards on the power
All right. Um. Do look kind of big. Okay. Once the game is over, each player's score is tabu tabulated. Tab tab tabulated. Um. Only the player with the higher power in the lane has their power added to the score. In other words, no matter how high your power in the lane may be, if it is less than your opponent's power, same lane, it will not count toward the score. After calculating the winner for each lane and adding their lane to the player with the higher power. Okay, after after practicing a little bit, it's not that difficult of a game, and it seems fairly quick if you know what you're doing. So we may do a few more extra ones whenever we get the chance to see them. And we see one right now, but we will not be doing that. Oh, you can see the things through the Okay, that's all this is all good. Okay. Of course. This is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the Good morning, sir. Right. I must apologize for not introducing myself to you earlier. I'm Broden, the owner of this inn. Your companions have all stepped out. Oh, but Barrett left a message he wanted me to pass along to you. You missed roll call, soldier boy. Luckily, you're on leave for the day. Don't waste it, though. Get your equipment checked ASAP. Sound advice. Just your party's gear bag. Assessing material equipment and perhaps a trip to the arms menu. dealer is in order. Good idea. By the way, Cloud, do you have any folios on you? Yeah. In that case, you might also want to pay a visit to Magnata Books. They have stores all over, but the first official one was built here in Calm, and their resident scholars are remarkably talented. If you want to unlock the true potential of your folios, you should go see them. The first customization is always free. I don't even know what a folio is. Can y'all give me a tutorial list Finally. or something? Rough day yesterday, huh? You've been waiting for me? I've been waiting for a chance to thank you properly. Without your help, I'd still be in Hojo's clutches, trapped in that lab. Mm. Was nothing. Even so, I owe you a debt, until it's paid. I'm going to accompany you. We like to see it, we like to see it. Oh, uh, if you're getting your equipment checked, have them check mine while you're at it. Sure thing. It's got a backbone. Overcoming challenges, helping people in need, and exploring the world will deepen your party's bond. Bonds. Thereby increasing your party level. The higher this level, the more skills and abilities will be available in your folios. Still not 100% sure what a folio is. But, uh, okay. Armed and dangerous. Okay, so we gotta go to both. So I take Tifa. Uh, morning. Morning. Everyone's kinda off doing their own thing. I noticed. Say, uh, this tank remind you of anything? Looks kinda like the water tower in Niwan. Right? Weird to think how much it meant to me back then when I was still there. I didn't realize the other option was the promise. I'm, I hate that I missed that. I didn't didn't see that. I, I was looking for the right answer when I should have been looking for the correct answer. Uh, <laughs> I saw two and I didn't realize there was a third that was like a promise that I made you. Uh, Cloud's actions affect his friendship with his allies and the strength of those bonds can. Alter portions of the story. Press L1 to view a comrade's feelings towards Cloud, as indicated as symbols as such as. Okay. All right, she's not feeling. She's not feeling me right now. That's okay. 
That's okay. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it there. We're gonna get it there. If y'all don't know why I, why I care so much, there's a there's a um, place later on in the game where you get to um, uh -huh. Finally decided you get to go on a date with whoever, whichever your friends yeah. are. So what you the higher doing? levels of why friendship. Waiting for you, of course. You have got business with the bookstore. If so, I won't keep you. But if you're free afterwards, wanna climb the clock tower together? Sure, sure, why not? Let's. For real? Awesome! Since it was my idea, I'll go get the tickets. I'll meet you in front of the tower, okay? Yeah, this this little makeshift date you're trying to plan, though, is not going to rule out the fact that you belong... You, nah, okay, pause. She don't belong to no one, but that you are uh, Zach's girl. Hey and Zach's my Welcome boy. I can't do that to him. <laughs> I take it this is your first visit to one of our stores. Well, customization can seem tricky to the uninitiated. It takes time and experience to get it right. But I think you'll pick it up quick enough. Let's give it a try. Skill points. Oh, it's a skill board. Locations and automats to argue, augment your party folios. This unlocking powers latent. Okay. Begin the tutorial. Okay, cloud. Uh, the orange skill course can be unlocked by spending skill points. Move the cursor over to one of those skill points. For now, move the skill core over oh, to this one. This displays the ability granted by the SB. Firework blade. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Look at that. Okay. Now to unlock it, hold X. Got it. Okay, you have mastered a new synergy ability. As you unlock skill cores, adjacent cores become available in turn. You are free to choose which skill cores to unlock and uh, when adapting a character strings to suit your playstyle. Okay, increasing the party level creates more skill cores. A character will earn SP when they level up or when not. they acquire manuscripts such as the Art of Swordplay. Unlocked skill cores can be reset at any time and the SP spent will be returned, so feel free to experiment with different... Okay. And that's about all we can do for now. But we haven't even skimmed the surface, believe you me. There's much more to this than meets the eye. It may not seem like it yet, but you'll see. Okay, that's an interesting interesting way to do the uh, level up system so i'm assuming you can't do that you can't do that like out in the field you have to come to a city talk to one of these guys and allow them to level up your your folio i keep wanting to say portfolio all right okay there's a lot of card games around here and i'm not trying to play them all All right, I'm assuming that this is the right direction to get to. No, no, it does not look the right. Oh, hey, Barrett. Look who it is. You up already? Drinking already? Uh, no, sir. Not gonna have a drop till Seventh Heaven's back up and running. <laughs> First one's on me. That's the right thing to say. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, now that yeah, that's what you say to Barrett. Alright. Um Oh boy. It's down there's more down oh, okay, nothing nothing special. Okay, this is a pretty decent city. They have outdone themselves now. Um would y'all mind giving me some type of, uh, I don't know, travel line on the ground to show me where I'm going? Or can I do that on the map? Can I do that on the map? I think I can do that. Armed and dangerous, and then... Oh, no, that's that's just... Okay. Okay. 
This is where we we're gonna go. I wish they had some type of uh, let me lead you here type of deal. Which would be nice. Y'all sound wonderful. Y'all sound really good. I feel like I made another wrong turn. Oh, there she is. Wait, Aerith. I will be there shortly. But I got a chocobo ice cream. I don't know how I like the, the sound of that. Oh, I just walked right past him. Okay. Welcome. All right. That is quite the weapon you got there, you got mister. There. Yes, it is. See plenty of action by the look of it. But saying that, it's still only a shadow of what it could be. With a oh, we know. Love, that we baby know. will sing. And you're going to love it, huh? I could awesome. show you. Maybe. Okay. Okay. Adjust your weapon skills via, the, via upgrade weapons. In the main menu, raising your character's weapon skills will unlock more of these skills as well as stat boosts, allowing you to customize your party to suit your playstyle. We've been wanting to do this anyway. Okay, the tutorial. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that upgrade weapon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, here you can see the party's current equipment, their weapon levels, and the amount of skill points need to, needed to reach the next level. Okay, select Cloud's Buster Sword. Selected. A large Buster Sword that has inherited the hopes of those who fight. I like that. A weapons, attributes, and acquired skills are displayed here. Now try equipping a weapon skill. Uh, the nodes in which you can equip skills are displayed here. Got it. Weapon ability damage plus 5%. Max HP plus 200. Here you will find a list of available skills, which, uh, I mean, select weapon ability damage. Okay. As you increase your weapon level, you will learn more skills and a lot more nodes in which you can set them. In addition to the upgrade weapon screen, you can also tweak your skill loadout by going to the material and equipment screen selecting a character and pressing triangle to set material if you wonder oh excuse me if you would pr prefer a more streamlined experience you can opt to automatically allocate skill weapon skills this can be done in the auto upgrade settings menu press the start button you can choose how to auto op optimize your weapon skills using the three available options this tutorial See, i like it what i tell you that girl is singing and she's got the voice of an angel just make sure you take proper care of her all right oh yes sir oh uh, new weapons can be found in the treasure chest during the travels you should you should but should you happen to miss one the local arms dealer will have it available to purchase new weapons can be found in treasure chest during your travel okay uh many of these merchants even stock the latest armor and accessories so be sure to check often okay what you got for me i got 2000 gil i think yeah 2000 gil sleek saber imbue your sword with fire and lightning while slicing a foe can use while airborne exploit an enemy's weakness that's 300 gil though, brother. I don't got that. I mean, 3,000. Hunter bangle. Bone bracelet. Um. Power waist guards. Revival earrings. If you would be capable of restoring one's fading consciousness. Grants auto life at the start of battle breaks upon use. Oh, that sucks. Increases spirit by five percent. Excuse me, increases magic power by five percent, increases vitality by five percent, and increases strength by five percent. One already owned, one already owned another area. I like this weapon and I want to buy this weapon, however, and if this works like the last game, if you up, if you um, completely level up the weapon you can add its ability to to other weapons which will be nice but i don't have the money for that so let's see if i can sell some stuff huh if i got anything to sell to get to 
brother this is a terrible script what is a cushion allows you to use broken down rest pops. um we're not selling those brother i feel like this stuff will be needed later like if i sold it i'd, I'd regret selling it but I will be coming back for that sword because that's a nice sword. All I have is two thousand skill right now. Nothing I can do. Take care of that weapon now. Don't worry, she's in good hands. Each weapon comes with a distinct ability, which can be used when the weapon is equipped. Using this ability repeatedly or meeting its proficiency bonus conditions will increase your proficiency. Max out this proficiency to, to use said ability even when you do not have this corresponding weapon equipped. I knew that. That was from the last game, and I love that part. Go to the clock tower when you are ready. All right. Mm, this one looks sharp. Is she talking about the weapon or is she talking about me? Because, I mean, either way, it's correct. <laughs> All right. Well, um, we're going to pause right here. I shall be back. And we're back. Let's keep going. What were we doing? I don't quite remember what we were doing. I think a date with errors. I see it in the top of the right. Climbing the clock tower. Okay. Cloud, over here. I like how after I accepted this, they made it a main mission. So like, I couldn't skip it. I couldn't like stand her up or nothing like that. Let's get started then, shall we? All right, hold on, let me. I'm gonna pass the top a little bit. All right, let's keep it going. What is that in the window? Is that a tree? Why is it so dark back there? Oh, excuse me. Uh, Eric, why are you running? There's no need to run. Excuse me, sir. I, I don't know why she's being so extra right now. Excuse me, ma'am. Hey, what were all y'all doing up here? Oh, okay. So big. it's bigger than I thought. Okay, I was like, this is pretty small for all y'all to be up here at the same time. I think Midgar's this away. Should be, yeah. This away. There it is. Look at that hunk of junk. Big pipes leaning Funny, all the way over it? there. How small it looks. It is far away. So, did something happen between you and Tifa? Hmm? Don't look so shocked. We're roommates, you know. She say something? Not about you two, no. Still, I can tell. She knows. I would have given anything to have a friend when I was growing up. Don't take her for granted. <gasps> oh, here comes these extra people. I can't believe people don't react a little bit crazier seeing Barrett's robo hand. It's machine gun hand. How do you know we're here? down the tower I guess oh I just got these prepared okay this music is fire it's 
See, this is when y'all make me mad. Like, I get y'all chasing us because y'all think we terrorists and stuff. Then y'all start terrorizing the people, bro. Like, come on now. Like, they did something. But if they start shooting at me, brother, I can't promise you no violence. I can only say I'll try. Not here. Well, we will take the back here. Hey, you. Seen anyone else suspicious? Well, that's a heck of a way to act about terrorists that look like everybody else. You seen anybody that looks suspicious? It's okay. I'm on your side. Got a contact at HQ. War with Avalanche? Not exactly. Stop. I'll keep the troopers occupied. While we're talking, you two go up and over. Okay. Sounds about right to me. I do wish they would have made the mechanics for, uh... Climbing a little bit more active. We're searching for some fugitives. Have you seen any instead of just holding the direction? I don't know. I was, ask, I was about to ask why they're still like crouching, but I forgot that this loud helicopter is still above my head right now. Look at this thing. So hopefully we're not spotted from above. Look at these freaking helicopters, bro. No, but we're still searching buildings. Oh, that scared me. We gotta find them. Their eyes in the sky was actually looking. They'd have found us already. Your vision sucks. Just saying. We see you. We see you. Oh, they're hanging above. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. That went well. The end's not much further. But stay on your toes. We're here now, baby. Where are they? Down below, waiting for you. The tunnel in the basement will take you outside of town. Leave now, and they won't catch you. Head to the east. A friend of mine runs a farm out there. He'd be happy to help you. Also, take this. Cell phone? It's a transmuter. <laughs> Converts raw materials into more practical items. A Republic antique, but it still works. You'll get more use out of it than me. Okay. Why are you doing this? Could have just turned us in. Yeah, I could have. But this town and I have a history with Shinra. Who knows? Maybe this will turn out to be the worst decision I've ever made. So before I change my mind, you better get going. Ooh, at least he's being honest with you.
the atom transmitter screen in the main menu, you can convert raw materials into practical items. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Cool. I can now transmit a potion, an antidote. Well, yeah, we'll do the tutorial. Because why not? You know, why not do the tutorial? All right, begin tutorial. First, open the item transmuter menu. Increase your craftsmanship and acquire transmitter chips. We'll expand it, right? Okay, cool. These are the materials and necessary amounts of the selected item. Here you can see the requirements. A potion. Excuse me. Oh, a sage is a sage and oh, the grass. Sage. <laughs> All right. Sage and plants blessing. All right. That sounds, sounds cool to me. Okay. Transmuting an item for the first time grants EXP, which increases your craftsmanship. But sure, uh, uh, be, I don't know why my reading sucks today. Be sure to create new items whenever you get the chance. Transmute a potion by selecting it from the list and holding. X. Through transmutation, you can keep up or um, keep your supplies topped up without needing to buy. Materials can be found out in the field or in chests and gained through combat. There are also items that can only be obtained via transmutation. So it's like alchemy in uh, Dragon Quest. Pretty much. Matter of fact, that's pretty much what it is. Anyway. Get the recipes from around the world. You can create crazy items through transmutation. Hey, guy. You made it. All in one piece? For the love of... Where the hell have you two been? On a date. Kind of. What? Uh... Well, that was the last one. At least till things calm down. <laughs> what the heck? Air trying to sabotage me, bro. Got that? Uh, oh. Okay, Dad. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, okay. I mean, I feel like I was going to do that anyway, but Barrett was just standing there in my way. Where to now? Where there's a draft. This way. Looks like a job for me. I, the way they did that, that uh, visual, I thought something was going to fall on their head or something. Go, Aerith. While I collect treasure. Okay. Laurel, or whatever that is. I got y'all back. I'm just making sure ain't no soldiers following, you know what I mean? Oh, but then I gotta open the door. Right. I gotta hold this? Oh my oh my gosh. Ooh, that is bright. Yeah, that is bright. Wow. I believe this is just look at it all. Possibly so the start. Clean. Of the other portion of the demo, where you can just kind of roam this area a little bit. I didn't play that part of the demo, so this is my first time experiencing. A living, breathing <laughs> planet. Even after everything we've done to it, it's still going strong. It may look that way, 
but in reality, it's barely hanging on. Guess I still have a lot to learn. What do you want to know? Hmm. For starters, how do we cross these planes? Come on now, that's easy. The same way you get anywhere. Pick a direction and start walking. <laughs> left, to left, to left, right. I guess we won't be coming back anytime soon. Guess not. This game looks really good. Let's go. I love Red, man. I love him. Love him so much. He reminds me of Scar, but like if Scar was a good guy and magical. Um, just your battle party for combat set incident. I mean, you can create up three. You said party for something. Okay. Uh -huh. The map get your bearings while you marker. Okay. Oh, I don't like how all y'all turned around to look at me like that. Oh, wrong pause button. Oh, I did push the right pause button, but... Oh, one thing I know that was spoiled of me in this game is there is no setting for auto pickup. There'd be items everywhere, but there's no setting for picking it all up automatically. I'll have to manually tap triangle for all this crap on the ground. But... There's one at the end of the game when you beat the game, they give you auto pickup, which I think is a terrible... Whoa! Okay. Fighting is Red 13. Red 13 can definitely take down enemies with his razor sharp pop fire. Okay. Oh, I like fighting this Red. This feels a little bit, uh, just a little bit more active. Oh my gosh, I love that. That combat was smooth. I like that. That was nice. That was real nice. Real nice. So, okay. Um, so we're heading toward the orange thing. Okay. I assume we can just kind of go all over the... Um, place like it's completely open world there's no paths I have to stick to can I can I just I don't I don't want to test it honestly oh okay I did it didn't lose any health that time We find useful supplies hidden along abandoned facilities and settlements. Open all the chests in the location. To mark it on your map. Okay, that's complete. Okay, I can't go over here or anything. Okay. 
Look at Tifa just chilling down there. She's like, y'all can have that. I ain't doing all that now. Nothing up there. Oh, there's a chest down there. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I definitely opened it up a little bit. Oh, man. Oh, this is this is two different areas. for this area oh I could climb down over there seems to be a few boxes so Aerith and 13 are my climbers the other two kind of stayed behind I guess they didn't want to climb but it's which is somewhat understandable I feel like Tifa would be a climber in real life oh there she is <laughs> they are up here why'd y'all stay back there earlier participate in the whole thing not half of it all right, there's a chest back that way, so we're going back this way. Can y'all do that? I guess they can. Climbing challenge out here. Ooh. Locate the tra There's two. Okay. Okay, understood. There's two. Uh short jump come on let me jump down no it won't let me jump down. okay if it's too high they won't let you jump duly noted oh here's one pain and miss potion okay number two right here and now it's marked okay it's complete high potion we like to see it we love to see it Google metal and something else there. Okay. There's some more boxes. Nothing in those. Waste of time. Okay, I can't just go under that. Duly noted. I don't think we could just jump down there. So Man, there's a some, some things that way. Alright. Oh look, stuff to grab. Like everything because I'm a hoarder in video games like this you never know what you're gonna need to create bigger and better stuff hey that's what I saw it I can't get oh what is that up there don't look like we can get to it right now all right, I think we did full circle back up somewhere kind of clear, close to where we were. This music is really good. Very relaxing and soothing, I feel like, for now. Take all that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh-oh, we got some some boyos here hold on hold on sneak around sneak around whoop ah uh. oh my gosh oh you're done Ugh. Ugh. I don't have any synergy abilities with anybody right now so my R1 doesn't work like this bing you're done ay 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 Okay, I can go in here now. Great. Look at this. Look at the crew. Look at the crew, brother. 13, 13 has always been about that action, but this boy is just... This is a squad, fam. That's a squad. All right. Material. Next, equipment. Let's see what we got here. Um... The only weapon we have at the moment oh we're gaining money though from somewhere i wonder if it's from beating enemies 
so he didn't keep the equipment he had in the flashback. He lost it, actually. Ooh. Excuse me. <clears throat> I have no idea why I'm yawning too much. Oh, uh, you know what else I can do real quick? Uh, where is it? Um, system DLC bonuses. Moogle Trio will take it. We'll take it. Leviathan, an orb of Leviathan material. Cool. We'll take it. Uh, the Final Fantasy VII remake saved that into something Leviathan. And then these are for my early access stuff, I think. Kupo Charm and Survival Stuff. Kupo Charm, five potions, three mist potions, two bottles of either and or ether, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, ether. And elixir and five cushions. Collected. Awesome. Now, equipment. Wow. What do we have here? What do we have? All right. What is the healing material? Need to remember to use my my material. Sess. Chocobo and Moogle material. This is one you get from DLC, I think. Or maybe you get it from the start of the game. I don't know. But we have a freak material, Shiva material. Hmm. <laughs> Mugo Trio material looks pretty cool. Choco Bow and material looks pretty cool. But we about to equip that Leviathan material. That looks fire there. It looks fire. That looks fire. We're gonna we're gonna equip that bad baby. All right, um, Red 13 has some space. What you got here for, this, for these, but Oh, he has poison material. Interesting. Precision defense, focus material, okay. He has no upgrades yet. Okay, so all the material that I have is slotted into somebody's stuff. So we don't have any new material yet, just the, the stuff that's slotted in somebody else. Um, prayer material. My HP restoration. Wait, does that mean somebody, did anybody have my? He has the lightning material. Hey, yo, bear it. I'ma need that up off you, big dog. Hey, yo, hold on, hold on. Let me get that. Let me get that right now. Yeah, sir. I don't know where I put it though, cause I need health. I could use. Yeah, yeah. Let me get that up off you, big dog. Mhm. Mm you can have a fire. Yeah. Let me. Ah. Let me take that up off you. And you can have a fire material that Cloud has. Yeah. If Cloud, the lightning material, cause especially when I get my um, what if they have it in this game, the. Uh, the material that allows you to um, imbue your blade with whatever material that's connected to it. Oh, we need that. We're gonna need that. Tifa has chakra material as well as ice material. <laughs> oh gosh, I wish I would stop yawning. I have no idea why I'm yawning. I'm not tired. I don't feel tired. Low iron, maybe. Um, all right, we chilling. Hold on, do I have to up? I have to upgrade the ability in the Buster Sword, even though it's my default weapon. Okay. All right, combat settings. I have arrows set here, but we no longer have arrows selected in our party. So we're gonna get a. Uh, we're gonna put a set there. Nope, we already have a set somewhere. Um, I feel like I should have potions on hand.
Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna do high function. That's fine. All right. Do bio for red and one arrow. She has the arrow. Let me get you a potion up in here. Cause, uh, actually, no, we you do the arcane ward circle and then you get this uh potion on X. Barret maximum fury items. Oh, or or what does he have any other no nothing it's fire now maybe i'll give him the fire yeah and then tifa focus strike spells blizzard Okay. Cloud is the leader as of now, but then we can also edit the party. That's so cool. Okay, so you only have three slots in the swapping party members. I, presumably right now, will be sleeping on Aerith most, most likely. So we're going to swap her out or Tifa for now mainly because I just want to fight as Tifa see how it feels and I know Barrett is fire so whenever I am um, get tired of 13 which I probably won't for a while because he's fire I like fighting as well I'll swap Barrett in but there seems to be a couple different layouts I can have here Oh. I like this. We can see. We can see too. Yeah. 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 I like it. this. Is okay. All right. I think we are. Stay hydrated, you know what I mean? You gotta stay hydrated. Yeah. I think we're um we're good to go for a little bit more. I feel like I have a lot of footage already within the last three 30 minute pieces I've recorded. So uh yeah, we can go a little bit longer and then yeah, we'll call it there. What was that about? Doors lock. All right. For the sake of time, we're just gonna go ahead and head to our destination. Get the story moving a little bit further, because I mean, we could spend hours, probably hours, just exploring the terrain, and fighting enemies. all this stuff there's something to, to, to climb over here so I think we should climb it so why not so what I just said we should not do exploring yeah I know I know still already It's in my nature to explore gods, okay? It's in my nature. Okay. So much stuff. Everywhere. Oh yeah, we're supposed to go to the orange. Seems this is the farm right here. 
Hello, people. Grab all that. Hey. Yeah, pretty much tough now. have to sell. I don't know if there's anything of value. This stuff that can be used in... Whoa! Ruby. We found a ruby and the rarity is, is seven stars. I don't know. What's the highest star? Emerald. God. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to sell any of that. Uh oh. Ah, oh, cushions are a hundred dollars right now. Where where would they normally? It only has one in stock anyway. What? But what? What's the purpose, brother? <laughs> that? Honestly, also not worth it. It's hoping it might have that weapon in here. Guess we'll get it in the next town. How do I earn money in this game, bro? So far, I've not found anything worth selling. It's important to make sure they've got plenty to eat. Oh, Need is this my guy? So you would be the avalanche, folks. It's okay, I'm on your side. Heard you be heading my way. You're safe here, but not for long. By the sound of it, Shimmer's leaving no stone unturned. No stone. I want to hold up at the old no stone by the swamp. I'd wait your Shimmer's forgotten is even there. Where are we going? 821 meters. I'm assuming that's meters. 821 meters. Yes, it's meters. It wouldn't be a mile. How much running does one have to do in this game? Thine is out of their mind. Wait. Thou are out of thine mind. I think I'm working all of this. Uh oh. Oh, I gotta swap characters for this, right? I think it's Aerith. Yeah. Master, son. Invoking summons when in the heroes of battle, the throes of battle, the heroes. I'm sucking at reading and talking and all the things today. The entity slumbering within an equipment summon material may begin to stir, prompting the summon guards to appear. When it draws, before you can call upon the deform entity for assistance. We don't need it right now. Now. Oh, get juicy. Oh. All right. Uh, before I get too far into this, because uh, because now, because now. 
I'm about to set it. Edit party. I wanted this. This part. This one. Right here. This is the one we're set that one right there. Yeah, yeah. Those big guys. Well, well. If it ain't my favorite group of hitchhikers. Oh, fancy meeting you here. Thanks again for the right to call me. Uh, don't mention it. It's the least I could do for two such lovely young ladies. But I do believe I neglected to introduce myself. The name's Bill, and you can count on me for a lift anytime. Except today, that is. Afraid the old butte's pulled up lame. Sorry about that. No biggie. Mm. We're enjoying the fresh air. Thanks, though. You, uh, know someplace we can hunker down? Hmm. Hunker down, you say? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> I'd almost forgotten what it was like to be young and in love. Whoa. You'll just head straight that away toward the swamplands. Chill out, brother. Find an abandoned building by the dock. I guarantee no one will bother you there. Why is he being extra, bro? I mean, yes, yes, yes. Cloud and Tifa, absolutely. But chill, brother. You're going to mess it up worse. Oh, man. Got to turn that alarm off, man. It always interrupts my, my videos while I'm recording. And wow, it's already 8 o'clock. Time flies when you're playing games. Or time flies when you're having fun. You're not going to want to attack me by nature, are you? Because I don't want to attack you by nature. You seem nice. But a part of me does want to attack you. I kind of want to just fight them for the assess stuff. I want to try to assess the... Hey! Exploiting enemy weaknesses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was trying to do. Um. Oh, I don't have any. What's the name? Yeah. Oh, why? Oh. All right, they're pretty slow. Okay. Abilities. Assess. Need to get in the habit of assessing. Yeah. Okay. Wow, staggered. Fire and ice are effective. Okay, fire and ice are... They don't like elements. Tifa, what you been doing? Sis? to get the hang of using that using as assess material 
so right okay right now everybody's just kind of meh with me right now they're just like mm. they don't hate me though which is good No, y'all are too cute. Okay, whatever. Attack too far, so I don't feel as bad. Uh, oh gosh, I hate when I do that. Ability, assess, that little guy. Oh, I missed? Water sport, brother? Hold on, bro. Did I miss the assess? What the heck? Ow, that hurt. Got him. Okay. Oh, no exportable weaknesses then, I guess. Got him. Bing. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're, you're, get him out of here. Let's see Red 13 do something. Sidewinder. Just like that, okay? Hey, that's nice. Okay. Okay, we're building a building a decent understanding of the combat system. Yeah. Oop. Okay. Got all that. Got all that. Seems pretty cool at the place. Not really. Um, I just saw a chest. And it's perfect, so I want it. Sleek Saber? Okay, this is the... So the game did say you will find these weapons in chests around the world. But if you miss them, they will be sold at the shops. So, glad I found this. Because, um... As much as I love the Buster Sword, I would love to swap this out. That's so cool. <sighs> I'm tired of yawning. I have no idea why I'm doing so. I don't. Um. Uh, oh, I have a new materia slot, I think. Or did I already have that in the Buster Sword? And it's just okay. No, it's an extra one. Here. Okay. Okay. So I have another spot for it. I don't know if I have anything new though. Anything that somebody doesn't already have. I'd be taking something from everyone else. And usually that'd be okay with me, but nobody, nobody have anything that great, so... For now. Alright. Music is interesting. Firebolt blade. Okay, we need to change the combat settings so that I could change. Um, let's change brave beer, braver to firebolt blade, and then we'll change triangle to braver. Yeah. That way, when I'm pressing square, I can rush L1 and already be pushing square, and I'll do it in beginning. All right. No sign of Shinra. Yeah. Looks like an old Republic landing. Could borrow a boat, make our way across. Then, 
Head on through the mines and keep going till we hit Junon. Sure. Why not? You'd trust these rotting hulks? I mean, we could. Let's not. Then maybe we swim it. This swamp <laughs> is home to the deadly Midgard Swarmer. Beware. But even if you're slow, you can rent a chocobo. We'll see you safely past being nothing if not fast. So just give Bill the word and he'll pick you out. A bird! <laughs> chocobo! Well, can we rent some birds? Can we? Fine. <laughs> Why do you say it like that, bud? Why you say it like that? You know you like that little scene. It was creating. Chocobo Ranch. We love the chocobos. The birds. Give me all this. Yes. That's a rat. I do not care, bro. Oh. Hold these. Hold this. Hold this, dude. Oh, they're teaming up. I didn't even see the little guys. I just started attacking. I didn't know what I was attacking. Ooh. Oh, this is active. This is active. Hey, hey, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, my God. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. Ooh, aerial combat's better than ground combat. I am still in the air. I'm still technically in the air. That's my first time hitting the ground since that. Whoa, brother. No, sir. Since that started, bro. Boom. You're done. Oh, okay. Let me. You're welcome. Or right. I gotta get the hang of using Cloud a little bit better before I start switching characters. I still ain't mastered him yet. Massive world, man. We're still going. What you look at this? Oh, and look at this. This is the scene that was in the commercial, for sure. I just don't think we, we have what it takes to activate it yet. Bro, get... Why don't you ever run up on me like that? I don't know what's wrong with you. you got an Indian. Hold on. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. He over here think he just gonna get away. Nope. Not today, sir. Not today. Hey, hold this. Wham. Wham. Oh, it's an aerial. It's an aerial starter. Oh, he's dead. Okay. You're done. That move starts us off on aerial attack. I like it a lot. You still got. We attack first. Oh, look at the little rat thing. I saw that sitting on that cliff earlier. Ledge. Where'd it go? Oh, I was about to say, I know you're here. Oh my gosh, he's not there anymore. He disappeared. I wasted that. Hey, hold this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Excellent. Excellent. I'm already having fun with this. This is pretty good. It's a pretty good game so far. We haven't even gotten anywhere. Apparently this is a pretty decently long game. Which is why I will be cutting out a lot of the editing stuff for this playthrough. Hey, hold that. Bing, 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 bing. Bing, 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 bing. Mink, 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 mink. Get him out of here. Next. 
Oh, 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 and hold that. You're done. Oh my gosh. I feel like he just smacked you in the back of the head with a sword, bro. Um, okay, so I mastered this ability, I think. Oh gosh. I did. I mastered the fireball blade. I'm gonna keep using it for now. Even though I mastered fireball blade, so I don't have to wield this weapon anymore. So let it I'm gonna, I'm gonna start trying to switch characters a little bit more. I feel like I'd enjoy that a little bit more. But, um, I think it gets so hard to, to let go of the Buster Sword first. Pleasure to see you all again. And welcome to my humble ranch. So he could teleport. Got it. Managed to get your truck fixed? Indeed I did. You must have been my lucky charms. She started up right after you left. I was about to say, that had to be... Anywho, One what can I do you for? Fast you in the market bits. for some fine feathered friends by any chance? Are we ever? Need them to get through the swamp lands. Then you have come to the right place. That's Back what you're saying. We had Republic ferries to get us from A to B, <laughs> but now they're nothing but driftwood, sadly. We got the next best thing, though chocobos. To them, a bottomless bog's no worse than a kiddie pool. Now, ladies. You're probably wondering, what gives these birds the power to glide across swamps with ease? Are y'all wondering that? Would you believe that their fluffy feathers give them the buoyancy to float, while their limber legs can outrun a motorboat? Not even the dreaded Midgard Sormer, one of the fastest fiends around, can keep up with them. Oh. Uh, wow. <laughs> but you don't need convincing. You just need pointing. To a hard working chocobo, nature's two legged limousine. So, can we rent some? Hmm. Sure can. My grandson Billy's in the stable over yonder. He'll help you out. Hmm. Ooh. Yeah, this is still the same discount, I think. Yeah, I feel like these are the same discounts. I could be wrong. But I think they're the same. Alright, um... Gotten here, oh, okay. Cutscene. Howdy. I wasn't trying to. It's on the side. Need some chocobos to cross the swamp. I'm sorry, pops, but you're out of luck. Pops. Pops. Got no more birds. Last one went this morning. Could have fooled me, kid. These are spoken for. That or they're not fit for riding. But I can see you're in a bind, so I'll bump you up the list. For a price, of course. Which is? Ten grand each. <laughs> Fifty grand? Is, we don't have that kind of money. Or any, really. Hmm. Well, there is one other option. Only cost you a grand. Uh. Is what a scoundrel might say. But I wouldn't dream of distressing y'all further. Just so happens one of our birds ran off the other day. Wild thing, but still a fine chocobo. If you can manage to find and catch him, then he's yours. Free of charge. You sure? Yeah, why not? Name's Pico. The hardest-headed bird you'll ever meet. By far. And 
he's the spitting image of Pops here. <laughs> Bruh. You can start by looking for his tracks. Find those, and you're sure to find the feet that made him. Now, wild chocobos can be a bit skittish around people. But if you play it cool and creep up real quiet like, you'll wrangle them no problem. I think we can do that. Thanks. And one last thing. This info comes free of charge, provided you promise to stop by our shop. Speak to Chloe back there. She'll sell you whatever you need. <laughs> Kid's a born businessman. <laughs> <laughs> if y'all can catch our runaway and get his butt back here, riding and rearing lessons are on me. Shopkeeper Chloe. Oh, but first, let's steal from you first, of course. Like, why? Why? What else will we do? Timeless rod, huh? Should that be for? That, uh, that was about to be a stupid question. Obviously, the only other person that's carrying a rod with him is Aerith. Aerith can have her do stab. Timeless rod. Chrono ages. It damages and temporarily freezes the enemy. Ooh. 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 Oh, brother, we're using that one. Yes, ma'am. I like that. That's pretty cool. Um, I see other stuff oh, that's outside. Oh, I'm just knocking over this stuff. Why did they make all this stuff so interactable though like i wasn't intentionally knocking it over it just was in my way <laughs> sorry about my brother all he thinks about is money he's just doing his job we understand i suppose but he's been a real pain about it ever since our parents left mm. Say, did they leave on chocobos i guess that don't matter does yeah. it why'd yeah, you ask a stupid question like that then oh. do you happen to know chocobo sam um not very well, but yeah, I guess we do. Where is he? Probably the Sector 6 slums. He's a big deal in Walt. Um, why do you ask? I was thinking about reaching out. It's his fault mom and dad are gone, so... Chloe, that's none of these good folks' business. But they could help. Don't tell anyone what she told you. Sam's one of the biggest names in the business. If he gets wind of that story, our ranch is done for. Don't worry, your secret's safe with us. I promise. Oh, take these greens. You can give them to Pico when you find him. They were always his favorite treat, you see. Maybe he'll come back once he's had a taste. Right. He's all greens. Stuff, huh? Billy will throw a fit if I don't at least try to get you to spend a few gil. No pressure, but if anything catches your eye. Also, if you have any golden plumes on you, I can exchange them for chocobo gear. So be sure to hand them over if you do. Golden plume? Oh, those, okay. Chocobo gear, what about, okay. I don't got no golden plumes on me, man. Yeah, I don't have that golden. This is pretty cool though to get the, put a, put armor on it. Hmm. Most of these things are things that I have. So no, I don't think it's that. I hope Pico doesn't give you all too much trouble. Just go track tracing the track. All right. Well, for the sake of putting a bunch of different uh footage together because i did a few pauses and cuts even though i said it would be unedited it will be a little bit of editing due to just untimely time management and all that stuff but um yeah we're gonna pause the first episode here um second episode will pick up with us finding uh the chocobo so we can get across the world on a giant bird because who wouldn't want to ride a giant bird I know I would. I don't know about you, but I would for sure. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to comment down below if you got something to say. Be sure to subscribe if you want to stay. And be sure, be absolutely sure to enjoy the rest of your day. 
appreciate you guys for watching i'll catch you guys in the next episode of final fantasy 7 rebirth seems like it's gonna be a good game and a long one strap your seatbelts in let's go for the ride together catch y'all in the next episode